everyone. So it's been a while since I did an actual tutorial. I've been doing pictorials. I've been tired, um, slowing down. I'm 58. Um, but I've been so excited about the Alice in Wonderland that I wanted to do a video. So we're going to start out with the gold. Um, the My inspiration is Alice herself in the Disney. Blonde hair. She's got blonde hair. She has um, a blue dress with a white apron, a black um, headband, and that's where my inspiration is coming from today. I think I'm going to go with this gold right here for her blonde hair. I might mix it in with this one, with this gold right here. The other one, just to warm it up a little bit, and the other gold. I'm gonna dab it in this blue right here. I'm gonna dab it in the white right there. For her white um, apron or smock. It's not very pigmented. The, unfortunately, the blue looks a tiny bit green because it's mixing with the gold. I'm going to just dab it in the black. The black is frosty. Just to give it a little more definition in the corners, kind of like making that V. Just a little bit. And then just in the inner corners, just going to dab it in that white frosty blue color. It's white. It's kind of, um, kind of chunky. But just to open this up a little bit, gotta put that in. Mm -hmm. Gonna kind of like blend that into the black. It's hard to get a, a um, sometimes it's hard to get the black to show if you're putting it over a frosty color. There, I didn't put enough, that's what. Okay, that's better. I'm gonna do my eyes clean up and then I'll do the rest of my makeup on camera. Oh wait, I wanted to try this shimmery color right here. I'm gonna put that over the white. All right, I'll be back. All right, let's use the bronzer which I'm using as contour I don't I, I do not bronze well bronzers don't look good on me you don't pop in bronze I don't pop in peach <laughs> mm. <laughs> uh -huh. 
Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm trying not to touch the shimmery part. So I'm using this angled brush. Doing my nose with the lighter one. I like it. I always have to do my nose with like a lighter contour, then I do my chin. I know people like to make a bump. I try to re, re like make the bump go back. <laughs> Minimize, that's the word I was looking for. Decided to use this pink. Uh, this one's called That Way. It's the for lips and cheeks. Let's see if I could blend it with this. Still got dirt on it or something. Let me put a lot more. Hope that's not mold. I'm going to use this gold pencil. Is there other brush? So there's four brushes. I use the eyeshadow. I'm using this as a highlighting brush. Um, I use this one for the bronzer or contour. Using this third one for um, the highlighter. And I'm just going to swirl them all together. did try this is just as good as any other wipes I'm using I've already been using this is so soft so I'm gonna use that for the face powder I'm just the first thing I try to do is blend out the nose so it's not so overpowering I really love the effect of face powder not only does it help to blend but it really like finishes the look. It smooths it out. I like that highlighter.
Okay. I'm going to be honest. I'm scared to use this. This really puts a lot of shimmer. Uh, but I'm going to try and do it like this far away. Because boy, does this give a shimmer. Okay. I'm going to use the other red pencil. Hmm. It's more like a pink. And this is like an orange red. I'm not really not happy about that. Ah, is this coming off as a coral on me? And I'm using I forgot <laughs> but it's the red one the red one with shimmer in it I'm just like really surprised that this didn't come off as an orange red but as a coral especially with the name Since I'm getting older, my hair is taking longer to grow. By now, my hair would have been down to my shoulder blades before. Um, <laughs> but anyway, yeah. <laughs> I'm really excited about this collection. It um, Amazon actually canceled um, their orders. If you could believe it, they were the first ones to put it for pre-order. It was supposed to be available at the same time as Wet n Wild's release date. Um, they had um, the um, the PR box was not available. Uh, the face shimmer and and I forgot to use the eyebrow products, but honestly, it's the same one. I'm pretty sure it's the same one that they did earlier this year. I really didn't like it. But hopefully I'll remember to use it next time. Um, it was supposed to become available on Sunday at Target stores. Um, I went to two Target stores just to check it out. Nope. Um, then just a couple of days ago, they... Um, a couple of days ago, they finally put it on their website. So... Um, they're usually supposed to tell you if it's available and which store it's available in. Um, when I first started calling around, they said that the one by me was going to carry it. So, um, not that I need it now because I got everything through the Wet n Wild website. Um, and at Walmart because they put up their... Um, their display the thing I didn't get though about that was they didn't have the lipsticks that was crazy um, they didn't have the eyebrow or the lipsticks I'm not sure if there was something else that they didn't have but that is crazy the lipsticks is gonna be a popular thing but that's where I got the stuff that was not yet available uh, but right now everything is available at wetandwild.com um, so you have them you can check your targets you can order your target online uh, Amazon, like I said, they are not, they canceled their orders. They're not pre-selling it anymore. Um, if you put it in your wish list, it should still be there. But they canceled some of the pre-orders. Um, let's see. Um, so yeah, by the, oh, and Ulta, if you want to get Ulta points, Ulta has the PR box for sale only right now. But by the 23rd, all the rest of the stores are supposed to get it. Ulta, Rite Aid, uh, CVS, uh, Walgreens, they're all supposed to get it. Um, HEB, uh, they have like the same buyers as Rite Aid. Uh, so um, they, they still don't have it out yet. So I guess they'll have it out when Rite Aid has theirs out the 23rd. Um, so yeah, that's... 
that is that.